All right, down we go. Hopefully, we're well on the way to finding Smashly again. We're definitely on the take here. Oh, uh-oh. Oh, this place. Oh, well, we're back into a nice cave area. Certainly can't escape them for too long in this game now, can we? Oh, dear. Yes, the humidity is good for my sinuses. Of course it is. All right, let's see if I can combine that with anything. Uh, no, but I'll probably need these healing items soon. Fuck, what I really need is ammo, though. I am so scarce. Might have to use my Killer 7 on the upcoming battle with it. <laughs> it will keep me busy, but I do have my Killer 7. Lewis's Memo 4. He's, he's still writing memos from beyond the grave. I'll report my findings about the Plagas here. The Plagas have three distinct characteristics. One, as I mentioned previously, the Plagas have the ability to manipulate the behavioural patterns of their hosts. Two, the Plagas are social organisms. Uh, by this I mean that instead of living individually, they live in perfect social harmony. It is believed that they have a collective intelligence. This type of behaviour can be seen as uh, seen among insects such as bees and ants. However, this kind of social behaviour is rarely seen among parasitic organisms. Perhaps it was a learned behaviour by the Plagas? I'm finding out if this has any relationship with their first characteristic. The Plagas have exceptional adaptation skills. They are able to live off many kinds of organisms by creating a symbiotic environment quickly. This ability, when combined with their social behaviours, allows them to interact intelligently between hosts regardless of the, of the host organism. I'm ashamed to admit that my pure fascination with the Plagas, in hindsight, has blinded me to the true research objectives of the Los Illuminados. Even with the knowledge that Sadler was going to abuse the results of these experiments, I could not pull myself away from my research. As a result, I am just as responsible for this whole mess as he is. I see now that I was wrong, but can I stop their evil plans alone? The answer is no. Apparently I have to do all that. Uh, yeah. Might as well save the game. It's been a while. There we go. Game hasn't crashed on us though, so that's nice. Although I did uh, have a cutscene problem when I alt-tabbed out of the game, if you remember last stream, before we went into the maze. <laughs> they just stood there and didn't talk Welcome. anymore. Welcome. The radio was just silent. Alright. Hey, we got some tune-ups. What are you buying? Let's tune up some things, broken Oh, here we go. Killer 7 upgrades. Uh oh, they're expensive. Uh let's get firepower going. Is that all? <laughs> Ooh, Thank yep, you. I can afford some things. Let's see. Reload Is speed. <laughs> capacity. <Is that> all? <laughs> Boom. There Thank we go, you. that's all we get for now. Oh, I had a strange dream about you the other day. You were hosting some Twitch event wearing a black suit, but your name was only Joe's. You had a famous lady co-host who was famous for something my brain made up, but now I can't remember. <laughs> that would have been the weirdest thing. That would have been the weirdest thing. Hosting a Twitch event. Like, for, for whatever reason, Twitch saw fit to have me co-host an event like that. Was, was it a hot tub streamer? Oh no, famous for something that you made up, but yeah, it's famous for um, being the first Twitch streamer to uh, be a competitive ping pong player using only her uh, her larynx. <laughs> she just she just spits out the, the, the ping pong balls or something, I don't know. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> They're wearing a black suit, as in like a, a formal suit or like a gimp suit or something. I, <laughs> I need more information. <laughs> Come back oh dear! <laughs> Let me guess. I, I I totally took the piss out of the whole thing. It's like, hey there, twi Twitchers, how's it going? Welcome back to the Twitch event of 2020-24, where we play some ass ping pong. <laughs> Our first competitor uh, contestant uh, is uh, Asmund Gold, <laughs> who has just recently been unbanned. Oh dear, going against uh, going against Fillion somehow, even though she's a VTuber. <laughs> Whoever makes it all the way to the end will take on my co-host here. Uh, who was the co-host? Someone. Formal suit. I'll thank God for that. <laughs> Gimp suit would be rather worrying, wouldn't it? Ah! What's this? There we go. Oh, it's a good thing Twitch would never, never have me on for one of those events. I'm far too problematic for that kind of thing. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, oh, yeah, I know where the last treasures are. There's one in, like, a little camp area, and then one over here. So, yeah, we're doing good. All right, I really want some ammo though. I am running short. I guess the uh, I guess the magnum ammo will be good against it, I suppose. But I don't want to waste all my magnum ammo because there's other bosses to worry about. Oh dear, that's quite the dream. <laughs> I've never dreamed of myself doing anything on stream before. Hey, would you look at that? We've got a yellow herb that we can't use. Actually, I'm gonna have to wait until Smashly comes back to use that. Because I can't extend my health any further. Um, alright. Something busted a hole in this fence as well. That's a bit worrying. Uh, it's all just a little bit worrying here. Alright. 
Oh, big open chasm area and a bunch of boxes suspended on chains. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this is a good idea. Yep, this is a great idea. Yep, going across the boxes that are uh, facing... Uh, yep, they're definitely hovering over a bottomless pit. That's great. Yep. <laughs> it's gonna be just fine. Weird that my brain changed your name only to Joe Singh as you had a co-host. <laughs> that makes it even more hilarious. Oh. Beep. Oh no. My waifu Ashley. tracker. Ashley. Oh no. What my wa my waifu tracker has, has fallen off Ashley's back. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, what are you? What the fuck are you? Oh, oh no. Okay, I think I might use the Killer 7 right now, actually. We're right in front of, uh, this fucking thing. Oh, you're not right. You're not right. Yeah, let's, uh, let's use this. I think that's a good idea. Fuck you. Fuck you. There we go. Nice and steady. Oh, he's fucking off. That's good. Oh, God. Alright. Oh, what's this here? Well, I fucked it. So, good. <laughs> Bust the little bulbs and do something. I don't know what we're doing. Operate. You've activated one of the emergency switches. There must be another one. Boop. Huh. Let's see. It won't open. Oh, activating what? Uh, activating the emergency system of this container rig might release the lock. Hmm. The emergency system's gotta be around here somewhere. It better be. So you'll notice that the- Oh god! Ay -ay 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 I did not duck properly. So you'll notice that the Killer 7 actually uses a clip as opposed to, uh, uh, taking the Magnum ammo and just loading it in one, uh, one bullet at a time, like the revolver. Oh, shotgun shells. Yeah, that's appreciated. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Here we go. No, bye. Got a booper button. You've activated both the emergency switches. The door should open now. I have to get out of here before the whole container rig drops. Oh, fuck. There we go. Fuck you. Oh, no. We've only got 23 seconds to get off this place. Tain is going to drop, and I'm pretty sure this guy can survive the drop. Because he can climb on walls and ceilings and shit. Oh, down it goes. Is it too much to ask for that he's gone as well? Yeah, probably is. Alright. Oh, hey, I'm out of room. Or am I? Let's just pop that over there. There we go. That's We're going to save that for Smashly later on. Alrighty. Hmm. Our inventory is looking okay. I'm going to keep using the Killer 7 for now, although it seems like it's a bit of a waste. Hmm. Yeah, I'm definitely not using it to shoot any of these buttons, though. Let's see. Oh, it's on the other side. Here we go. Smash it. <laughs> Don't want it. Don't like it. I'm just going to drop containers on it until it's dead. Ooh. Oh, no. It's right in front of me. That's not fair. <laughs> that is not fair at all. Nope. Get back. Yep, that's it. Good boy. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, it won't open, but there's got to be a way. Oh, shit. All right, let's get back out. Handgun again. There we go. Open door. Oh, okay. Dodge. Thankfully, I moved away from the dodge prompt, so I didn't need it. You've activated one of the emergency switches. There must be another one. God, where is he? Hey, 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 hey. Can I just go past him? Uh, uh I don't know. Oh, shit. Um, pfft. All right, it. There we go. Fuck off. Come on. There we go. Jesus, I don't want to waste too much ammo on this fucker. Oh no, where's the other one? No. No, how do I get back? There's got to be a way. There's got to be. Okay. Oh, wait, I see. Yeah, it's been a while since I've done this, clearly. There we go. Got to get the fuck out of here. I don't like this thing. No getting too formal with me before buying me a drink first. I know, this thing's getting real fresh. Don't like it. You've activated both switches. Door should open now. But we've got another timer to worry about. Hey! Oh, God. Keep going. What's this? TMP ammo? Fuck off! <laughs> don't need it. All right, next container. Jesus Christ. All right. Well, this is going swimmingly. Let's see. Better reload this in, these, in case I need to do some more button shooting. Keep your eye open for any green lights. It won't open, but there's got to be a way. Oh, hang on. I would prefer it if I had the Killer 7 on me. Go full Arnold here. Uh, let's see. I don't see any things to hit. 
Okay, there must be another one. Oh, okay, that just opens outright. Ah, shit. Hello. Oh, you've got a thingy now. You've got a thingy on your back. There we go. Can I just avoid you? Uh, yeah, well, I can just blast your face. That works. Whee! Damn it. This thing's starting to become a pain in my ass. <sighs> shit. Okay, thank you. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Okay, show yourself, dickhead. Ah! Right. Fuck you. Switch back to handgun. Try... There we go. Oh, damn, we still have to go back that way, though. Alright, hopefully that's the last thing we have to shoot. Switch back to Killer7 and pray to baby Jesus this works. At least he only takes, like, one shot to fuck off. There we go. One shot to fuck off is all we need. Oh, there's the button. Okay, you've activated both of the emergency switches. The door should be open now. Let's go. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Oh no. Alert. Exclamation mark. A wooga. The sirens bust. A wooga. Abandoned uh, container. Oh fuck. Oh, this is the last one. Ooh, a hook. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> so long, sucker. <laughs> And off he goes. Dear God. Well, that was fun. <laughs> At least it's over now. Oh, Jesus. All right. TMP ammo. Yeah, I want that. Sure. All right. There we go. Magnum ammo. That's nice. I used quite a bit of that. Um, Wait, how much damage did I take? Yeah, I'm, I'll just immediately heal now, actually. And some shotgun ammo as well. God damn it. I can't pick up the shotgun ammo without picking up the TMP ammo first. That's a pisser. Um, alright. How am I gonna do this then? Um, rifle ammo. I don't know. Glad that nonsense is over with. Uh, where's our... Yeah, the next treasure is at the camp. Which is coming up soon. Okay, let's just... Oop. Damn, they really want me to pick this shit up, don't they? Can't I just throw it away? Actually, I've got a better idea. That's only two shotgun rounds. There we go. Discard that. Then pick this up, and then we get five, so we actually get a little bit more than two. <laughs> Better than nothing, I guess. Right. Jesus Christ, Mr. Rapey McTism fingers won't cause me any problems now, I hope. Right. Uh, should I keep this uh, Magnum Revolver out? You know what, we got a lot of ammo for it, so why the fuck not? What's this thing? Oh! Hello? Oh, no. Yeah, no, we're not done with him just yet. Help! What a dickhead. Alright. First things first. I'm not wasting all of this ammo. Let's just keep moving. Get him here and then we'll just blow him up with an explosive barrel. That's my plan. Yeah, buddy. There we go. There's a little damage just to get started. Uh, it's not nearly enough, of course. Um, God, I'll pick that up later. Can I pick that up later? I hope I can. Okay, what's this do? Operate, uh, cage doors. Okay. Don't know why I need that. God. He is right on my ass. Um, fuck it. I guess I'll just plug that in there. <laughs> Good heal for Ashley there. Oh, no. Um, should I go in here? I don't think I should. Hey. Hey. Okay. Uh, this is not good. Operate the thing. Oh, get it, get it, Fuck you! It's not a good thing I've still got my knife. <laughs> okay. Come on, buddy. In fact, now I might switch to this. There we go. Let him follow us again. Then we're gonna lure him over here. Hopefully this works. Hopefully he doesn't come around the other side. From behind. Hello! <laughs> oh! Oh, I totally fell for that! <laughs> what a dick! Alright, time to magnum. There we go. Shit. It does do a lot of damage. Although, weirdly enough, if you use the, uh, the fully, uh, upgraded, uh, sniper rifle, uh, the starting one, the one that's a bolt action, it actually kills this guy off pretty quick. Oh. Oh, shit. He ain't dead yet. No, fuck off. So, it's actually better than the Killer 7 in some respects. Ugh. I mean, I'm, sh I'm shooting him a lot. Ugh. Oh, God. He's buried under the sand. Hoi! Jesus H. Christ, let's get out of here. <laughs> D 
Damn it, son, you are taking a lot of hits. Oh, he's back. All right. Not quite done with him just yet, I guess. Good thing I got all this ammo, I suppose. Can you- there we go. Fuck you. It is done. It is dead. Thank you! <laughs> oh, thank God. I hate you, It. Give me some things. <laughs> 50,000 petititors, I'll take it. Jesus Christ. All right, yeah, you took a lot of my, uh, my, my ballistics ammunition, but hey, you know, at the end of the day, at least he's dead, so fuck it, I'll take it. Oh dear. All right. Oh, hang on. Uh, let's have a look at our situation here. We are doing... Oh, which weapon should I use? I mean, I'm more than done with the uh, Magnum for the time being. Uh, shotgun's got some ammo to it. Yeah, I'll, I'll move back to the Red red 9, I guess. All right. Well, we deal, dealt with uh, Clory McFuckface. He's gone. Um, that just leaves us with uh, getting out of here. Oh dear. Let's have a look. Uh, exits out that away, I guess. Yep, all right. I'm fine with that. Oh, dear. Warning. Door. Yes, I know. <laughs> oh, good God. Things are going smoothly, though. As you can see, not too many sections left of the game. There's, like, one set piece here, which isn't really a set piece. It's more like, hey, go and deal with a camp. Set piece here. Set piece here. And then this is, like, the sort of the final area of the game, kind of. Not really, it's just kind of an extended bit there, so we're nearly done. Still have to do separate ways, though. Hmm. How long have we been going? Uh, two hours. Okay. Two hours isn't too bad. In fact, I will use this green herb right now. There we go. And we're back to full health again. Uh, yeah, if we can get this game done within the hour, that would be good, because that would leave us plenty of time for other things later on. Alrighty, anything here worth grabbing? There are other things. Oh, by the way, here's a fun little Easter egg. A little beetle here. In the remake, uh, beetles are well-hidden collectibles. There's one for each chapter of the game. Uh, not chapter, but each section, like the village, the castle, and the island. Uh, in, th in this game, though, it doesn't do anything. It just sits there like a like an asshole. You can shoot him, though, and then he flies off. Whee! <laughs> so long, beetle. Off he goes. Oh, right into the cliff face. <laughs> oh, dear. I don't know why they put that in the game, but it's funny. 